In this video, I will demonstrate how you can use the project management tool as an internal CRM tool. The first step is to create a separate project. In this case, it is called Studio CRM. From here, you can head into the project and into the project management tab. In the project settings, a number of factors are created across various stages in the sales pipeline. When setting up the phase, you can choose if you wish to assign a timeline, or you can simply leave this blank. If we then head into the board view, you can see an example of some CRM tasks. This is a list of all prospects, leads that are in your pipeline, where initial contact has been made and information on your services has been provided. The next step may be to create a proposal. This is where you might assign a due date and attach any relevant documents. In the in progress column, you track active leads. At this stage, you might have sent them a proposal, which you can attach to the task card along with any internal comments or feedback for the prospective client. By doing so, you'll have an active history record of any activity and how the lead is progressing. You may also wish to include a description of the project in the description field. The in review column is for prospects at the final negotiation stage. The Done column contains those prospects that are either confirmed and have become clients, or have passed a porky door or have been lost. A handy thing to note is that you can filter by all relevant phases, as well as all due dates. Overall, this is a great way to keep track of all of your sales prospects and activities using the project management tool.